Hello, everyone, and welcome to this episode of In the Bay. But today, we are going to take you out of the bay, and I am going to show you a secret for Mech Warrior 5. This secret is a free medium mech. And I am going to do it in the most expensive way possible to show you that it is a viable option regardless of where you start on the star map. If you're looking for highest efficiency though, you want to start in the house of Davion, which will start you directly next to the secret location. I, however, am going to travel from Steiner Space. So let's get started. Let's give me the intro. I should have something to say during these lovely loading screens. But all I can do is ask you to subscribe and like this video. It would mean the world to me. We are going to choose our insignia, which I'm going to go with a 40k reference. And confirm. Now, since I got dropped on a planet that luckily has a double heat sink in stock, I'm just going to go ahead and buy that because, you know, reasons. As you can see, I am doing the intro. I'm not skipping any steps. Uh, I... do feel the need to check out this griffin because in general I don't like griffins but this griffin the 1S it's not as bad as most griffins in fact it actually has some tactical capabilities and flexibility that the other griffin the 1N does not and, but more importantly it has an in-engine double heat sink now not bad for the flagship mech. Now what we're going to do here is we're going to go to the star map and we're going to zoom out. So we start on the far side on the rim end of the uh, Steiner space and we are going to get as close to the Chaos March as possible which will only unfortunately take us halfway that's okay. We're going to travel. Half a million, 76 days. It's what, two and a half months? Two, two and a half months? And that's my son dropping his headset. That's okay. So we're going to do it again, right off the bat. Uh, we have two million in the bank. Going to see how far we can get towards the Chaos March. Oh, we can get through the Chaos March. Shine up those uh, passports. We're going on our second long jump. We are going to jump into DCMS space for another half mil. Next. One million in sea bills down, right off the bat. No missions done. No mechs put into storage to lessen the amount of damage done to our wallets. Back to the star map again. Here we are in 
some very beautiful, colorful space here that is also known as the Chaos Marge in game. We are going to proceed up the DCMS side of the uh, star map here. That's our third jump. 1.5 million in sea bills gone. Right out, right out the, right out the window. Coming in for our fourth jump here. I believe it's this one here. Out of range. Again, there's two million right off the bat. No missions done. Uh, this is taking us a year in game to cross the inner sphere thus far, and we're not even at our destination yet. Back to the star map. Going to Valentia. memory serves this should get us a very interesting thingy hidden cash right there accept it accept now you go to your your battle max here and what's this a wolverine 2 that's right a wolverine 2 let's look at the internals of this mech UAC 5 tech 2 2 tons of ammunition medium pulse laser again tech 2 in the head and a SRM 6 tech 2 and the left shoulder with 2 tons of ammunition this mech is ready to roll right now it's good to go. And, seeing as is outfitted with near maximum armor, <clears throat> don't really need to drop any jump jets to get this mech ready to roll. This is what it looks like in the bay. This mech hails from the fall of the Star League. So that being said, if you want to start your game now from Steiner Space with not one but two 55-ton mechs, you're set up. And until next time, everyone, good hunting mech warriors, and remember... In a profession where men die young, remember to fear this old man.